Hey there everyone, it's Bob Martin, the RC sub guy with the Nautilus drydocks.com and I got a fun little project I want to share with you. I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but I'm extremely chuffed at the results that we've seen thus far. It's a different way of sealing the linkage arm on your cylinder. Let's take a closer look. So what we've got here uh, is something that I started playing around with probably four or five years ago, but my interest in it was actually rekindled uh, by the engineering endeavors of Tom Schalfent, uh, who's a good friend of mine and member of the Nautilus Dry Docks uh, team. And um, it's magnetic linkages but uh, basically the idea is that the entire interior of the cylinder is sealed off completely from the outside. There is no um, puncture, there's no hole going through to the inside, so it's a purely magnetic linkage connector. He's got some interesting ways that he went about it, and you can look at that on the forums of my website, but this is how I went away um, with this. So. We've got a standard sized servo that just goes through a chunk of brass tube and it's capped off here. So sealed completely. There's no way for water to get in. At the end of this little rod here is a, uh, a barrel magnet, a cylinder magnet uh, attached to the end. And now what I've got here, which I've, I've determined is kind of the secret sauce, is a pair of uh, ring magnets and they're just barely bigger than the diameter of this brass tube so I can um, push them on there and they start to bite but when you push harder you'll see it clicks in place very very solidly it, there we go now it's actually really locked in place you can see as I move it it's moving the arm of this powered servo so if I give this some throw it's very, very positive and precise movement that's being translated to the outside of the cylinder. So the other neat thing about this, um, and if you're familiar with my other products, you'll be familiar with this. This is my, uh, my click-on magnetic, the heavy-duty connector. Um, typically, at the end of your linkage arm, you would put the other end of this one. But in this particular case, because there's already a magnet, it just locks right in place and that is an exceptionally solid connection. So in practical application, you'd have your linkage going out to, let's say your rudder, um, just running it through like a guide bushing, just snap in place on the end of that magnet there. So kind of a, a, a bonus two for one for the magnetic connector. I don't know what I'm going to do. I have a hunch what I'm going to do is, is offer this as an option for our line of watertight cylinders. Um, this is just a prototype. The spacing isn't locked down or anything like that, but the production version would mean you could run two of these uh, obviously side by side uh, for all of your connections for your boat. Um, so look for that coming up here uh, in the future and I think if we're lucky again, we'll see if we can maybe make this as a standalone product. So uh, again, something I've been playing around with or at least thinking about for years, but uh, was was pushed to action by the engineering feats of Tom Schalfent. So a big shout out to Tom for that. Um, just my take on the same system, just done a little bit differently. I'm super excited on how that turned out. Um, Will you find it interesting and uh, hey if you have any questions or comments about it reach out to me anytime bob at nautilusdrydocks.com i'd love to hear from you if you like what i'm putting out here in terms of the videos please like please subscribe it helps me out a lot i'm gonna leave you with that thanks for joining me and we'll catch you next time